Hi guys. This is Diagrotech. Today, we are going to install Mac OS Big Sur version 11.3 on VMware Workstation. Believe me. This is the very easiest and simplest process with minimal issues. All we have to do is download, extract, import and change the language. It's very very simple and easy, no need to do some installation, editing, etc. Just follow this very simple instructions. First, we have to download the Mac OS zip file. Open your web browser and go to this website, I will attach all these links on the description below. You can see from the title it's Mac OS Big Sur version 11.3. Scroll down, you can see the file size is 11.5 GB. And you need a torrent downloader. If you don't have one, you can go to this link, download the BitTorrent Classic and install it. Scroll down and you will see the product information. The file name, created by Apple, version, license type is full which is amazing, release date, and it's multi-language so you can choose your own language. At the bottom of the page, you can see the previous versions available for download. Also, you need to download and install the VMware workstation, you can go to this link and click download, you can check my other video if you don't know how to install this application. Now, let's download the torrent file. Click on download torrent, open BitTorrent. I have received this pop-up because the file is already downloaded, I downloaded it first for the sake of this video. Let's now check the downloaded file, right click and open containing folder. Notice the file is a zip file so we need to extract it first. Right click then extract files. The file extraction takes time due to very huge file. Wait for it to finish extracting the file. We have to import this Mac OS Big Sur file on the VMware workstation. I will just have to move this file on my drive D where I store all my virtual machines. This is based on your preference. You can directly import it if you want. Now open the VMware workstation. Click on open a virtual machine. Locate the downloaded and extracted file which in my case is in drive D. You can verify the location. Now. Click on the Mac OS Big Sur then click open. This virtual machine is already pre-configured. You can just simply power it on. Notice the settings that has been pre-configured. You can edit the virtual machine setting if you want. Once done, click on power on this virtual machine. This virtual machine might have been moved or copied. If you don't know, Answer, I copied it, let's choose that option. Now, wait for it to finish the startup process. Congratulations! You are now running the latest Mac OS version. Notice that the language is on Russian so we have to change it to English or to your preferred language. We can check the current version details. Click on the Apple logo and choose about this Mac. You can see the version is 11.3. Now, let's change the language. Open the system preferences. Click language and region. The preferred language is currently set to Russian so we have to change it to English. Click on the plus sign then choose English or your preferred language. Click add language. You will be asked if you would like to use English as your primary language. Click use English. Notice that English is now the primary, we have to delete the Russian language. To do this, click on the Russian then click minus sign. To apply the changes, click on close or X sign. You will be asked if you want to restart your computer to apply the changes, let's choose that option. Now your computer will automatically restart. 
You can now select and change your region etc. You can restart now or restart later. You can check again your current version since it's now in English. The VMware tools has been automatically installed. Now let's switch to full screen for full resolution. Fantastic! I recommend this version, I've been testing this version for a couple of hours and I'm amazed by its performance and everything. Unlike the previous version, it's very slow and laggy. Sometimes it will even freeze. Well, that's all for today's demonstration and I really hope you liked this video. Kindly check my other amazing videos. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe and click on the notification bell. Thank you and see you in the next video.